and now the photon can move at the speed of light in a straight line. Until that point, it was bouncing back and forth among other molecules and other atoms right. and other particles. By the way, had that photon been moving in straight lines, you'd be able to see deep inside the sun. Oh. That's what light moving in straight lines means. Right, yes. Why is a window transparent to you? Because the light moved in a straight line through the window. Right. But then I s smoke the window. What, I, you know, what, do you, what do you do when you frost. frost the I frost the window. Right. And now the light, I can't get through. I got to jiggle a little bit. I'll still come through, but I'm not in a straight line. Right. You cannot see through the window. No, yeah, the window's lit up, but you can't see what's on the other you side. Can't, the light's coming through, but right. it's not a straight not line. Not a straight line. Okay, okay. Yeah. all right. So the photon gets to this place, an edge, where it can now escape for free. Mm -hmm. There's not enough above it to keep bouncing around. Right. That edge is the photosphere, and that is our definition of the edge of the sun. That's only using visible light. Oh, God. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I knew there had to be a twist to this. <laughs> so we are visible light biased. Right. I don't mind that. But don't declare that this be the diameter of the sun if the diameter of the sun is simply what your own damn eyeball can see. Right. Wait. Okay? Oh, my. Right. So if you look at the sun in x-rays. Okay. It has a different diameter. Really? X-ray photons are coming from a different place. Okay. A different surface. So we are biased. And I think we need the occasional reminder that we are eyeball biased. Diameter of the sun is where the visible light comes from. And specifically, yellow light. Mm. Okay, right in the middle of the spectrum. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet. Right in the middle. Let me keep going. Go ahead. There's a layer of sun's atmosphere on top of that. On top of this photosphere? Yes. You know what that's called? Mm -mm. The corona. Oh, yeah, okay. That's part of the sun. That's part of the sun. Why is your diameter not including that? Right. This, that's part of the sun. The corona, depending on where the sun is in its cycle, can be really big or really small. So that changes on an 11-year cycle. But wait. The sun has a magnetic field. That extends beyond the corona. Right. Right. That's called the magnetosphere. Shouldn't that be part of the diameter of the sun? I, I, it's part of it. It's part of the sun? It's part of it. It's, uh, all right. Yeah. I, all I'm saying is, if you seek the truth, my son, mm -hmm. be aware that the truth has many faces. Mm. One face may deceive you into thinking that it is the face 